Okay, so what I've got is I've got two harmonies here, and I'm using the Melodyne version where you can actually edit more than one um, vocal or instrument at a time. And I have her lead vocal already edited, so I'm not including that in this view, but I am going to be listening to it because I want to align these harmonies with her lead vocal. Like I mentioned, Lauren and it, Lauren is an amazing singer, so this is more just about um, making sure that the timing, the phrasing is all just perfectly in line. You listen to my pleading when it hurts too much for speaking. You hear my silent prayer. So we're listening to this low harmony. This, that's what we're looking at as far as the editing, but I'm going to show you a few little tricks. One is a lot of times you can just get rid of these little breaths and the spaces in between. All that does is just adds a little more noise that could be distracting. So I'm going to just take those little breaths out and Melodyne makes it very easy to do that. I also don't like to Melodyne um, the breaths and S's if I can avoid it and a lot of times turning them down which Melodyne has this great amplitude um, tool and I'm just double clicking on the blobs that I'm pretty sure are going to need to just be perfectly in tune. The double clicking just lines it up to zero. Now sometimes you can go in and play with these, but harmonies in general, you want to be pretty tightly in tune, like almost not humanly possible in tune. <laughs> you listen to my pleading when it hurts too much for speaking. You hear my silent prayer. So that lined up really, really well. Now we've got um, a high harmony and a low harmony. When no one seems to see me, your comfort never leaves me. I'm in your watchful care. So even though Lauren is an amazing singer and, you know, this, these harmonies she just whips up in like one second and sings practically perfect um, in one take. <laughs> um, there's still just an occasional, oh, whoops, I should have held that note just a little longer. And again, making sure that the um, harmonies are very much in tune and being careful not to melodyne the S's and the breaths, otherwise they start to get weird and even taking out some of these breaths. No one seems to see me. Your comfort never leaves me. I'm in your watch. Right there is where we have a little timing thing. I'm in your I'm in your watch. And I think it's mostly this high part. She doesn't go up quite as quickly, and you can even see it. I use my eyes a lot when I'm editing, um, just as much as I use my ears. So I can see exactly where those are going to line up. I'm in your watch. And then the next part yeah. probably doesn't. I'm in your watch. But now it sounds like maybe it was the low part that went up too fast. I'm in your watch. I'm not sure. I'm in your watch. I'm going to just pull this forward a little. Sometimes you don't know until you go the other way. I'm in your watch. It still sounds like the your is coming in just a little late. I'm in your watchful care. 